Hey guys, so how many of you guys remember what these are? I mean, yeah, it's been a really long time, but I'm hoping some of you guys do remember them because in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to uh, make a Pandora battery. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, in this video, I'm actually going to be showing you guys that the iPhone is now capable of running PSP games. And you know, I'm not gonna show you how to install the emulator. I'll have a link down below in the description that'll show you how to do that. But you know, I just wanted to show you as a proof of concept that your iPhone is now capable of running PSP games. And that's just a crazy, crazy thing to me. And it's been out for a little bit. Um, I never bothered to make a tutorial because it's not working. It's not at the stage where you can actually play it. But you know, I've had a lot of people ask me to make this video. So I'm just gonna show you a PSP emulator running on my iPhone. A little backstory for me, I actually started this channel making PSP videos. And I don't even know why I would start an Apple channel with PSPs, but um, yeah, it's, it's kind of funny. I do still have all my original PSPs. God, these things were amazing growing up. But yeah, your iPhone can now run PSP and the emulator is called PPSSPP. And you can find it in Cydia. And right now it's at version 7.0, but it does work. Unfortunately, it's still in beta stage, so not many ROMs do work with it, but it actually does work. And I'm just gonna show you as a proof of concept a couple games running on it. I know some people have gotten Final Fantasy on here successfully, but I've just got these three games right here, uh, Monster Hunter, Tony Hawk, just to show you that it does load and you can have the frames per second, little meter right there. And uh, here's Tony Hawk's Underground 2, it's a more recent game. The systems themselves are actually really old. Here is Monster Hunter. Now getting these games on here does take a while because they're big games and it actually loads. It's almost at 60 frames per second. Unfortunately, not all games are this fast. I mean, there's some that are really, really slow and it's just unbearable even thinking about playing on it. Uh, but you know, you do have Monster Hunter here and it does work. I have Chess Master, I don't even know what this is, but it was really small so I could download it and show you guys that it does work. Okay. Audio actually works and controls all seem fine. I really don't even know what I'm doing, uh, but yeah, so you can actually run PSP games. Like I said, there will be a little information down below on how you can get this from what source and all that. So click on that link and you guys can play PSP games. Now, like I said, you will not have a good time at it right now. Frame rate is 15, maybe 20 frames per second on most games if they do load in the first place, but I will keep you guys updated to let you know when it is working fully. Just wanted to let you know that this is now possible with a jailbreak, something that would have never been possible had we not been jailbroken. Anyways, guys, just wanted to show you this. I do hope you enjoyed this video. Have a great day, guys. Peace.